Pause. Pause. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Welcome everyone. Today is Monday, December 6th, and I am working on something in the air by Diamond Art Club. So as you guys know, I finished all of that area. I did all of this today. I don't know if you can see it, but I did all that today. I'm working in this little spot there, and I'm going to pretty much call it a day on this one. So my sale went okay. Um, I was busy. Um, I made my table. So that was good, and we made it over to the stage. <laughs> yeah, uh-huh. Uh, mm. I'll show you what I bought. So I bought one myself, one of these, for me and my aunt for Christmas. I bought these. Aren't these the cutest? Yeah, mm-hmm. And this was only six dollars. It's a no nighty. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry. It's a no nighty. I'm a bit obsessed with gnomes. And I got this. And this Harry Potter and this little dude. <laughs> I also bought this from my aunt for Christmas. It's friend's chapstick. And then, I'll show you the best part. Isn't it so freaking adorable? My new favorite bag, and it was the last one they had. And it comes with a little... I put my stones in here, because I don't really trust change in this thing. In case somehow I forget to close it and whatnot. So I just put stones in there, and I keep it closed. Like, I carry crystals. But yeah, it's so cute. I absolutely love it. <coughs> Right now it's like windy and snowy outside and it's horrible. Horrible. So yeah, we went to um well Saturday. Um after the show we kinda relaxed and vegged and then we ended up playing cards. We ended up playing cards, and then, uh, it was an easy night, because we had to wake up early, 
to go over to the states and you know stuff like that and, and um Saturday or Sunday was states and like I said we went to Walmart um it felt so weird being over there because like they don't have to wear masks and stuff like that some people wear wearing their masks like we were wearing our mask and everything else it just felt so weird and totally different and um and then I did go to Joanne's but I didn't buy anything they didn't have what I was looking for so that was kind of a bust but that was okay and it was busy in there there's only like two checkouts open and like there's like 10, 11 people online, and it was just nuts out. So, um, and then we went to Big Lots, and that's where I got the, the chapstick from, and then, oh yeah, I got some shampoo, and, um, I, cause, mm, I was using Function of Beauty, and, I like going all natural and stuff like that, but sometimes, like, it's just good to switch it up, um, a little bit, so I actually bought Head and Shoulders to try and help, um, just to use it for a little bit, because I'm not letting my good shampoo go to waste for nothing still, so, like, maybe, like, once a month or whatever, I'll, I'll use my, um, special shampoo, and then I'll, the rest of the time, I'll just use like head and shoulders I'll do like every opposite week where I use head and shoulders and then I use the function of beauty because I've been having like this dry scalp like right here and like I, when I changed it I did put like because with function of beauty you can like um pretty much choose what you want so I did change it to dry scalp and I feel like it still wasn't like helping so it hasn't been as bad since I started using the head and shoulders so like I said I'll probably just alternate every other week maybe or you know just do whatever it is an expensive shampoo um function of beauty I don't know if anyone else uses that uh, what else did I buy Oh, I got my grandma's shirt for Christmas. Isn't it so cute? She she will love it. Love, love, love it. Yeah, might as well take off the tag. Duh. So I also bought that. So uh, yeah, <laughs> like you're not seeing anything. <laughs> and I got my water. I love this water a lot. Mm. Oh yeah, I was in like heaven. When I was able to get stuff that we haven't been able to in like years. So yeah. Um just seeing the time. <clears throat> It was a good day yesterday, you know, like I said, it was just, you know, it went smoothly, like even going back into Canada was just a little bit of a wait because we went through the tunnel and there was like only four lanes open, but it actually went by not bad, like probably about 20 minutes really, um, but we had a little bit of a heck getting there because there was a, like a big accident on like I-70. Was it I-75? I don't know, but we 
like the two last lanes on the highway we had to like merge into the other two lanes so that was kind of like a little bit of a backup um situation but yeah, yeah um like I said, it was good. Like, we didn't go into any restaurants or nothing like that. Um, we're not ready for that just yet, but if things hopefully stay well, I'm really hoping, um, because we want to go again next month. We, we're going to try and go once a month. Before, like, before COVID hit, like, we would go every two weeks to the States. And that was just our thing, you know, like, we would go shopping and... Like, me and my mom and my grandma, we have a really special bond relationship. I don't know what it is about the three of us. We just get along with each other. And, like, we just do everything together. And, like, we travel together. We, like, watch movies together. We play games together. Um, like, like card games and stuff like that. Um, and we spend a lot of time together. And I think that's really important. Oh, the snow was a menace. Oh my goodness. I, I would turn you around to see it, but I doubt that you guys would even see it at all. Really? It's like... It, like, I can see it, but I think it will be hard for a camera. I don't know. Can you, can you see it at all? The snow? Like, it's that white, like, dust, like, just blowing everywhere. Well, it's not, snow's not really dust, but, um, it, it's just, yeah. I don't know if you can see it or not, but it's just horrible outside, and it's, like, windy as ever. It's, like, really cold, and I guess, like, what my grandma said the other day, too, is that we're supposed to be getting, like, a whimsical winter like meaning like it would be like a day like today and have snow and then it will be like warm so it's like just gonna be like one of those winters I guess that we're supposed to be having I don't know it is what it is right and that's a part of being up north this is about that's why we get all four seasons and I think it's amazing that we get all four seasons you know um, because, you know, we get to experience it, like other, like other areas like Florida or whatever, they don't get snow, they just, well, they had, but very little, um, I'm not saying it cannot snow, it has, um, but they're sunny all year round, so, you know, it's just like one of those things, right, so, My favorite season is that like definitely fall and and summer because like even though it gets stinking hot, I still like it because I like going to the beach and I, I like doing that. And then fall, I feel like it's just like the perfect weather. It it like it brings a nice breeze and it's just one of those things. Spring, like even though spring and fall are both are rainy seasons. However, like, um, I just like them a little bit more. I just find it very comfortable. Well, especially in the fall. Spring is, it's all right. It's like kind of like the same. It gets cooler and a little bit warmer. And I guess it's not really the same thing because spring is getting closer to getting warmer and fall is getting towards cooler, I guess. Um, I just... I, I, I don't know. I just like summer and fall the best. I'm going to try and finish this little area of the moon and then I think I'm definitely going to call it.
a day with this painting. I did a lot on it. I've been working on this since 12.30. And I meant to do one earlier. I just... I don't know. I was just in the mood of, on getting, getting, getting a lot on this painting then, <laughs> I guess, if you want to call it. Now, like, when I start, I get really started, you know. Like, I just sit here and put on the TV and just do my own thing and just enjoy it and watch it coming to light. And I think that's why I love this craft so much because with each different piece, it just does no justice. Some of them are bad, bad compared to others. I guess it all depends on the size and the style that it's in. Um, don't get me wrong, I've had crappy canvases before. <laughs> oh my lord, yeah. Um... But I never had anything bad to say about Diamond Art Club. Diamond Art Club is a really good company. I like them. And I like their beads. Their beads are amazing quality. And I love their canvas. And I love their artwork. Their artwork is amazing. Some, like some of them are eh, neither here or there, but I like you no know, one's like, especially like those Harry Potter pieces that just came out. I love them. I wish I had them. Honestly, I, I wish I had all Harry of those Harry Potter pieces, but some of them are already sold out, unfortunately. So, you know, it is what it is, right? I'm just thankful for what I do have. That's pretty much what it comes down to as well. Like, it's not always about what you do, do, do or, 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 it's not always about what you have and don't have. That's what I was trying to say. And it took me a long, long time to realize that as a human being. I didn't realize, started realizing it till like, a couple years ago, you know. And like I said, I'm still young, too. I'm not perfect. There are really, really smart people in this world but I doubt anyone's perfect if so then we're all bloody perfect <laughs> but that's just not the case and that's all I have to say about it My ankle's doing, uh, I have to tell you this. So yesterday when I was at Myers, being on me, I ended up tripping over something and I hurt my ankle and I hurt my ankle during, earlier in the week when I was walking to my friend's house. I tripped on the sidewalk and then yesterday, yesterday it was, I'm like, I just scale from one to 10, it was like an eight. So I kept it up. And, you know, <clears throat> I kept it up. I'm like, eh, it still hurts in a couple of days. I may need to borrow one of my grandmother's cane. <laughs> um, it was, like, really hurting yesterday. Today, it's not so bad. Um, but last night, like, because me and mom were watching a Hallmark movie. And it was hurting a lot through that. Like, I just kind of kept it elevated and stuff. I'm still not going to overdo it or anything and make it worse. 
Um, right now, I kind of have it, like, elevated on my chair a little bit. Well, not on my chair, but, like, on um, one of the things I have underneath my desk. So, yeah, it was just one of those weeks, I guess, where I like to trip over stuff. And then yesterday, oh my god, like, I'm trying to drive a cart. It was horrible yesterday. And it didn't help because I had a bad cart as it is. It's like, you know how, like, one of those things where you, like, have one of those shitty carts in the grocery store and it just stops and then, like, it goes? I must have, like hit things like seven times yesterday at Walmart. I'm like, oh my god. Yeah, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, that was me. Mm. I had, I, I was bad. <laughs> I'm like, I, good thing I don't drive a car yet. I'm like, I should have just got a new car and I was just too lazy, I guess, not to get a new car. Cause like I already had a bunch of stuff in there, and I just I I made do I made do with it. I mean I dealt with it. Blech. Right term. So yeah, that was pretty much about all my weekend. So it was a good weekend, you know. Fun. Interesting. <laughs> and that's that for today, ladies and gentlemen. So... I don't know if you can see it or not, but this is where I was working all right in here and all in here. So I hope you guys liked this video today, and I will be back with more later. But on that note, bye for now.